Another multiplayer DK mini game. Okay. And this time the bananas are worth just their normal amount. So we're only getting one coin for each banana this time. Alright, uh, what's the mini game going to be? Oh, we're playing Stump Change again. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We got 12 of them. I guess that's pretty good. So that means we're going to get uh, 12 coins right there. Alright, uh, now time to head to Yoshi. Ten. And he's losing some coins on the red space. Now it's my turn. I gotta use the uh, Super Shroom Warp here so this is the last turn. Alright, let's see if we can get a good total with this. Alright, ten. Four. And two for a total of 16. I don't think that's gonna be good enough. Alright, I'll just go up. Yeah, this is not gonna be enough for me to uh, get to where the star is. It looks like I'm landing on a bonus mic game. But uh, we already know it will not uh, happen just like I've explained uh, several times. Alright, two versus two, mini game to finish things off, and it's gonna be Battery Ram. Alright, Yoshi's my teammate for the last mini game. Alright, let's see how we do. Alright, we're almost there. Come on. Just a little bit more. Come on, Yoshi. Yes! We just barely got it. Alright, now that the last turn is over, it's time to go over the final results. Alright, let's take a look at everyone's stars. So, looks like Burrow and Dry Bones had the most stars in the end with two, while me and Yoshi have one. Alright, let's take a look at our coins. I had the most of those at the end with 130. Alright. Now it's time to go to the bonus stars, and let's see what they are for this game. Minigame star, action star, and red star. Alright, let's start with the minigame star. And that's gonna go to... Me! Alright, on to the action star. Let's find out who's getting this. There are two of them. 
Oh, it's me and Yoshi, okay. Alright, now let's end things off with the red star. Let's find out who's getting this. It's Birdo. And the winner is... It's me! And that makes me the superstar! How amazing is that? So we end up with a total of three stars for this game right here. And that was pretty intense right there for how it turned out, but I'm glad we were able to pull off the win in the very end. And, and Mark should definitely be uh, very, very proud of me for that right there for sure. Alright. So anyways, let's go over our detailed results before we wrap things up for the segment. So, uh, uh looks like, uh, Dry Bones, uh, spent the most, uh, uh, coins on the orbs with, uh, 30, and Birdo uh, was the only, uh, person out there that didn't spend any coins on the orbs. So it looks like, uh, and me and Dry Bones uh, used the most orbs with the uh, five. Oh, I very uh, traveled the most spaces by three over Yoshi. Dry Bones landed on the most blue spaces. And Burl had the red star uh, by two over Yoshi. And me and Dry Bones were, were uh, the two players out there that did not land on red space. Yoshi was the only one that landed on a character space. Uh, so me and Yoshi have one green space while Birdo and Dry Bones did not land on any of those. None of us landed on any dual spaces. Birdo landed on the most of my spaces with two while the rest of us have one. Me and Dry Bones have one DK space while uh, Yoshi and Birdo did not land on any of those. And none of us landed on any bows or spaces. And let's also take a look at our graphs. Alright, so that was definitely a very exciting game right there, and uh, I'll definitely uh, take home that win for sure right there. We're also going to get 311 cruise mileage points. Alright, anyways, that is going to do it for Mario Party 7 for the Nintendo GameCube as part of Mark Leota's birthday special, but we still have some more games to play. In fact, we're getting uh, much more closer to the end of this birthday special right now as we currently have five more games left to play, so I will see you all for the next segment right after this, so stay tuned.